What's going on guys? Today, old man Isaac throws out his back and I have salmonella. And something else. He sounds like garbage. And I think a cold. Hopefully it'll be cold. <laughs> It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Man, that thing is awesome. But actually, we're work <coughs> but actually we're working on the steering and the alignment and the shifter again because we got an upcoming drag race right between this and the ah. mystery vehicle. Uh, okay, I was about to say, I'm don't tell them, go. don't tell them, let them guess. Yeah. So I may or may not be dying from all kinds of different ailments, but we're working on this lawnmower anyway because I mean I want to see it hit 40 miles an hour, man. Let's let's check the alignment. Oh, we're gonna do the board trick? Yeah. I like that idea. Wait, so tell the people how you messed your back up. Getting the lawnmower out of the garage. That thing's heavy. Yeah, it is. And I didn't realize I hurt my back until I got here. And then it's like, oh. He plopped down on the mower and didn't get up for a while. What you got there? I have a Go Power Sports axle. And <coughs> hopefully we can knock off these uh, blocks pillow blocks, and we're gonna use it for the alignment. Visit GoPowerSports.com for all your lawnmower alignment needs. That's right. I'm using these tiles on this floor. I've centered up the lawnmower on the tiles, and now I'm using these bars, this Go Power Sports axle and a flat bar there, to uh, kind of see how far the uh, alignment is off. I'm not worried about the camber. caster or camber. I'm Although just, the camber is pretty ridiculous. It's pretty sweet. Are you going for zero toe? Yes. Look how far off this is. Yeah, that's bad. That's why she's so s sketchy going down the road. This sketchy. is off probably because of the tree incident. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> so I'm gonna want you to hold that tire and I'm gonna twist on this one to try to get the alignment. All right. I'm not sure that bar's gonna be strong enough, dude. This one? Yeah. This one has never let me down. Well, prepare to For be let let down. down. <laughs> Ready? Yep. Reach out. Okay. Set her down. I don't think we've done anything. <laughs> this side's towed in a little bit. This side's towed in a little bit. I'm so we did do something. Yeah, we did do something. A little too much. Yeah, take two. Take two. Oh, that. That was probably too much, but. <laughs> when you drop your car off for an alignment, this oh. is what happens. What are you doing, man? Got a little bit too anxious. Towed in a tiny bit. You see it? And take three. <laughs> There's nothing sketchy about this. Are you ready, sir? Yes, sir. What happened? Uh, I'm I'm towed out way far. I should nice. have just left it alone. In the past, this thing has had a tendency to be really darty at high speed, which uh, is hopefully because it's had too much tow. I mean, when we uh, lowered this thing, we literally just eyeballed the spindles and said, that looks good, go ahead and weld it. Um, yeah, we didn't go through all this. No, not at all. All right, that's, I'm leaving it. Yeah, that works for me, man. Whatever gets the job done. Um, we gonna look at steering? I think, no. I think that was the... Uh, that was the alignment? The alignment. So we, we're not gonna mess with steering. I don't think so. Today I have cars and cameras. Ike throws out his back, I have salmonella, and we're not messing with the steering. <laughs> I, I don't know. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> whatever, whatever, I don't care. So, I think we're good. Cool. Shifter? We'll work on the shifter. Sounds good. Uh, I'm gonna stack some extra washers on this front wheel to try to get rid of some of that. Oh, the looseness. The looseness? Yeah. Which might 
help a little bit. Tighten it up a little bit. Yeah. Too. Yeah. That sounds good. Uh, we have lined it up. <clears throat> I have stacked washers on the hub to take up any slack. We're tightening everything up. We don't want anything to make it sketchy. So I, uh, ingeniously, is that a word? Ingeniously? That'll work. Sure. Okay. All right, stack some washers on the inside of the, uh, of the wheel there to tighten up the wheel. It was a little sloppy before. I did the same on the other side. And, and why did I do it on the inside? To widen the stance. Wider for better. more stability. That's right. Which is brilliant. Thank you. Yeah. Kidneys. All right, so I cut out the old linkage and um, I just got a brilliant idea. Well, I hope it's brilliant. For the new linkage. Yeah. We got this uh, pipe right there. And we are gonna have some linkage going from here, which of course we're gonna have a longer arm here and we're gonna shift it. I'm gonna say that's sixth, fifth, fourth, third, second, first, neutral, reverse. Hey. But look at it's a floppy yet. It's all the way forward. Rubbing. Oh, I forgot we have real throttle. Yep. <laughs> I like it. So after this, we just need to go buy a new belt. Yep. Um, and then we can go for a ride, right? Kind of looks like it. Sweet. Look at that face. I got some snot coming out of my nose. Wanna see it? No. <laughs> That's what happens when you hoon the lawnmower too much. <laughs> yeah. You get belt all in your torque converter. Dang, dude, it's like a yo-yo. Oh, wouldn't that be the coolest thing? Walk the dog, man. Walk the dog. That's what happens when you get cheap yo-yos. <laughs> Actually, this is probably about the most it's expensive one. It's like the most one. expensive yo-yo ever. Proud of yourself? Kind of am. <laughs> you know why I'm so proud? Because I got it all off. Nice. Yeah, buddy. So the store is closed, so we can't buy another belt, but tomorrow morning we're gonna go out and we're gonna buy another belt. We're gonna do uh, some testing with this thing. We're gonna do some hooning! Some hooning to see just how good our alignment worked out and to see how our shifter holds up. So, see you guys then. Before, when you take that thing down the road, it would it would drive all crazy. It looked like it was doing very well. Oh goodness, here he goes. Let's see, let's put it in six. Oh man. Oh, oh god!
I think he's catching the lawnmower on fire. Yeah, we're gonna start a fire. Oh, oh no. Oh god. Back up, dude. We got a fire. Back up. <laughs> we got a fire. Back up. Dude. Oh no. Take it out of gear. It was funny until I realized the gas was right there. Oh. Did you, did you upset some neighbors? I don't know. I might have. I stopped filming and I saw all the smoke and I was like, he's catching the lawnmower on fire. Because when you were coming down, it was smoking pretty good. Yeah. It was very twitchy. It was like... Do you think a flat road would be better? No. Honestly, I don't. Well, do you want to see what the top speed is real quick? Yeah, let's let's check it. The uh, There's too much play in the steering wheel. Yeah. So it's like, but there's a lot of play, but whenever something does happen, it a lot happens. Uh-huh. Well, if it gets to the 40, we're fine. We're golden. Yeah. No need to... Uh... It's definitely had more in it, though. So I did 37 in the lawnmower, uh, not 40, but uh, it could definitely get there. I just, I almost died as it was. So Ike's going to give it a shot. You're not going to try to hit 40, are you? Only if I feel comfortable. Only if he feels comfortable. Check the speed again. Okay, we can check the speed in reverse too, because I just tried reverse. Okay. We did 41. You did 41. Uh uh, uh you're sick, bud. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Yeah. 41. Woo! Yeah. So we did it. Yes. I only did 37, but I'm perfectly happy and satisfied with that number. I don't want to die. I thought I was. That was like probably. That was scary. Probably the second scariest moment on Cars and Cameras history for me. Really? First being that time, the 670. Oh, the got away, but you were yeah. laughing. It was because it was just, I don't know. Anyway, so next time we are going to put this thing in a drag race against a mystery vehicle. And uh, we might take it out to dirt chickens to see if it'll drift on a dirt road or on a rocky road, right? Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. More good stuff to come. Um, should we paint it? I don't know. Let us know. No? Okay. I mean, like, I'm kind of on the fence about it, too. But, anyway, we got to thank Go Power Sports, as always. Check us out on Facebook and Instagram at Cars and Cameras Reviews. Check him out at Isaac It'll Be Fine on YouTube. Yep. Let us know. I'm pretty satisfied. The steering is still really scary. Uh, but, it is scary, but it'll do 41 yeah. And I'm satisfied. You have the rotation of the uh, drum, axle, whatever. Uh, the ideal thing is to have, since it's rotating this way, you want it turned probably around, around there somewhere. You have this end attached somewhere.